Hi everyone, welcome to your yoga practice. Today we have a super gentle, relaxing practice. We'll all be on the ground, nice and slow, with a nice long meditation at the end. I recommend you grab a pillow or a bolster, something soft and squishy and cozy, and a blanket or a towel. Go ahead and grab your things and we'll get started. So our first pose today is a child's pose. So you might open up your blanket, placing it maybe at the center so you have a little extra padding here for your body. Bring your knees onto your blanket. You can let your feet fall off of the blanket. That way you have a little extra support here on the ankles. Bring your pillow in front of you between the legs, or you can scooch it further away. You can play around with that. Make sure it's how you want it, comfy. And then start to fold yourself forward onto the pillow. You have a few options here. Maybe you bring a cheek to the pillow. You can also bring your forehead down on the pillow, but if it feels like it's really hard to breathe, skip that and bring the cheek down instead. If you like this variation, go ahead and stay in that variation. If your knees are feeling sensitive, you might choose to instead take either the blanket or the pillow behind the knees and sit back onto your support there. And that may feel safer on the body. Once you've found your position, allow your body to soften into the support of the ground and of your props. And start to notice your breath. If you have the pillow underneath your chest and belly, you might be able to feel the movement of your torso against the pillow as you breathe. And each time you exhale, encourage Encourage your body to soften just a little bit more. Now as we move through our practice today, if you find your mind wandering, that's okay. Take a moment to notice where it's gone past or future, and then redirect your attention to the sensations in your body. And that might be the sensations of the muscles, or maybe it's sensations of your breath. If you've taken one cheek to the mat or to your pillow, go ahead and switch so that you can have a nice even stretch on the neck. Continue to maintain your attention on your body, softening, letting go. Couple more deep breaths.
as you're ready, and slowly begin to transition onto your hands and knees. If your wrists are sensitive, you could come to your forearms or your fists instead. Go ahead and shift your props out of your way. Notice any sensations. And we'll stretch the right leg back. Bring the ball of the foot down, bring the weight back, stretch out the calf. So after the knee has been bent for a while, this can feel nice to open back up. Release the right knee and switch sides. Stretch your other leg back, ball of the foot down, lean back. Open up the calf, open up behind the knee. And release your left knee down. Moving into cow and cat. Inhale your chest forward, tailbone up. Slide your shoulders away from the ears. Exhale, round your back, tuck your pelvis, finding your calf. Inhaling, cow. And exhaling, cat. Keep going, following your pace, your breath. A few more times. Go ahead, find a neutral spine, and come down to seated, maybe sitting on your blanket. So depending on your body, you might choose to sit completely on the blanket so that your ankles are supported. Or if you're feeling like your knees are really high, you might choose to fold your blanket up a little bit so that you can have a little extra height. So this might be enough. You might choose to do an extra as well. And from there, you'll sit on the edge of the blanket and then come into that cross-legged seat. So you see how then it encourages my knees to come down. So if that's more comfortable, that's fine. We are moving towards a forward fold, so you can decide. I'm gonna go with the halfway, so kind of halfway between the two. So I have a little bit of support my ankles are just on my mat, but my mat is quite squishy, so it works out okay. And we'll bring the pillow in front of us. You can take one leg in front of the other, we'll switch later, so it doesn't matter which leg. Everyone's different here, so it may feel good to just have the pillow nice and long and let yourself fall onto the pillow here. If you want more height, you can fold your pillow or grab extra pillows. Bring your forearms down. You could stack your fists. For some people, this is really challenging, so no need to force yourself. It doesn't matter how low you go, as long as you feel comfortable enough to release and relax. We're not here for too long. Just about six deep breaths on this side, and then we'll switch legs. Notice if you're holding any unnecessary tension. And if you are, with each exhale, allow that tension to soften.
Last breath here. Start to press your way up. Just remembering transitions are just as important as the poses. Feeling the changes in the body as you rise. And you can either simply just switch the crossing of the legs if you need to for a moment, you can stretch out those legs. Sometimes having the knees bent and the ankles in that position for a long time is uncomfortable. And then switch, other leg crosses in front. Same options. Take your time, it will probably feel different here with the other leg in front. And allow yourself to soften. Again, if your mind wanders, notice where it goes. And then come back to your breath, to your body. Slowly start to lift yourself up. Lean back and undo your legs, stretching them out in front of you. And bring your hands behind you. You can be on your palms or on your fists, whatever feels better. Push down into the hands so you're lifting out of the shoulders and open up the chest. Take a couple breaths here. Make sure your neck is comfortable. So some people do like to drop their head back. But if that feels unsafe, please don't do it. You can keep your chin tucked. One more breath here. Go ahead and lift yourself back. Scooch your pillow or bolster off to the side. Come off of your blanket and put it off to the side. And come down onto your back. Make sure your props are still nearby. We'll want them in a minute. Once you've made your way onto your mat, allow your knees to be bent, ankles underneath the knees. We'll do a little bit of pelvic tilting. So on your exhale, you'll tuck your pelvis under, press your low back into the mat so that natural arch in the back will go away and your tail is tucking between your legs. Then as you inhale, you'll go the other direction. So tail reaches towards the ground and there's a natural arch that intensifies or gets bigger here so you could slide a hand underneath. So exhale, low back pushes down, tail tucks between the legs. Inhale, arch the other way, tailbone towards the mat, lifting the low back off the ground. Exhale as you press the low back down. Inhale as you arch. Two more times at your own pace. Go ahead and find a neutral position. So 
Pull your right knee towards your right armpit, left knee towards the left armpit, and rock a little side to side here. You can widen the knees more if you want more inner thigh action here. And then pull the knees towards each other. And we'll move towards our final meditation. So you'll take your pillow underneath the knees. So this gives your low back a little bit of support. If this isn't enough support, grab more pillows, place them under your thighs, under your knees. You can also go with bent knees if that's better. If you'd like, you can take your blanket under your head. Now, I would keep it quite thin. We don't need a big pillow here. We want to keep our neck, neck, our neck relatively neutral. So you can play with that. If that's not comfortable, get rid of it. It's fine. Make sure you feel warm. If you need to, you could take a blanket and place it on your body. And allow your arms to rest alongside the body, maybe even a little bit out. And then as you're ready, close your eyes. Tune into your breath. feels okay, allow your breath to slow down. So we'll move to a body scan. This body scan moves pretty quickly. What I'll be doing is mentioning different body parts. And as I mention that part of your body, you'll bring your attention, all of your attention to that body part and encourage it to relax and soften. By the time you've done that, we'll be moving right along to another part of the body. We move pretty fast. And the goal is just for you to be here with your body. There's nothing specific. Just allow yourself to be present. Bring your attention to your right hand. Move your attention to your right wrist and let it soften. Right elbow. shoulder, right side body, right hip, knee, ankle, your attention to the whole right side body, toes all the way to the fingertips. The whole right side body as if nothing else existed. Moving on. Bring your attention to your left hand and let it relax, let go completely. Left wrist, left elbow, left 
shoulder. Left side body. Left hip. Knee. Ankle. Foot. your whole left side body. Toes all the way to the fingers. The whole left side of the body as if nothing else existed. Shift your attention to your torso and pelvis. Feel your pelvis, front, thighs, back. Feel your belly, chest. Upper, middle, lower, back. Feel your neck, head, and face soften. your whole body, your whole body. Begin to notice your breath. Invite movement into the body. Wiggle the fingers and the toes. Allow your knees to bend. Take your time. Begin to roll to one side. And then use your top arm to press yourself up to seated. When seated, bring your palms to touch in front of your heart. A moment to thank yourself for taking time to take care of your mind and your body. Namaste.